Introduction to Audiology, CSD 2750. This is a three credit course, and I am Dr. Suzanne Miller. The course is only held online. The best way to get in contact with me is through my email address, millers2 at stjohns.edu. I can be met at my office in St. John's Hall, room 344J, or we can meet over Skype. You could also call me, my number is 718-990-8020, but the best way to get in touch with me is definitely through my email address. This, of course, is entirely online. So we're going to talk about measuring hearing, pure tone screening, speech audiometry, admittance testing, interpreting audiograms, screening procedures, and pathologies of the auditory system. This is a course that is required if you want to become a speech pathologist or an audiologist. It's required for all graduate programs. Our course goals include understanding the fundamental concepts of audiology, gaining knowledge of patient characteristics, talking about anatomy and physiology underlining, underlying the hearing and vestibular system, interpreting audiometric information for both adults and pediatrics, describing the nature of service delivery for audiology in an educational and medical setting, and the impact of cultural differences and diversity on audiological services. By the time this course is over, you should be able to know how to perform a basic audiological evaluation, how to classify the type and degree of hearing loss, and interpret audiological test results. The textbook is Introduction to Audiology by Martinick Clark. They put out a new edition every year. Um, the, any edition beyond the 10th edition is fine with me. They don't change very much year to year. So please go ahead and buy a used book. I follow along with the edition from 2009. For this test, this course, there are going to be three tests, each worth 15 points of your grade. Again, this is all going to be through Blackboard. So the tests are going to be composed of multiple choice and short answer. They're going to be timed and through Blackboard. You're also going to be required to write an abstract style paper. So you're going to select a current journal, any topic that we cover in class. And I want you to basically summarize that article. So that includes writing the introduction, the methods, um, the results and the discussion section. In three to four pages, you're going to be asked to submit this paper at the end of the semester. About halfway through the semester, I'm going to ask you to share the journal that the journal and the article that you're going to be summarizing. You have to do four hours of audiological observation and one hour participating in an audiological screening at the St. John's Speech and Hearing Center. Each of these is worth three points. So you can schedule your observations at the St. John's Speech and Hearing Center or with any audiologist that has their C's. For the one hour participating, you can call the speech and hearing clinic and tell them that you are a student in my class and you want to get your hearing tested. You're going to share your experiences or reflection through discussion board. At the end of each chapter, there's going to be a set of review questions. Each of these review questions are worth one point. So for each chapter, there's going to be my PowerPoint on Blackboard, a set of course notes on Blackboard, and a video for you to watch. Once you've completed all of that material and you feel confident that you know what you're doing and you understand the material, go ahead and take the chapter quiz. Chapter quizzes are worth one point of your final grade. Also, course participation and online professionalism. Every now and then I'll assign a different video. I want you to watch it. I want you to participate with the class and always be professional. So like I said, the best way to do this is to log on to the site the first day of the week, look over your work, make a plan, listen to the YouTube recordings. They're going to be embedded in Blackboard, or you can go to my YouTube site, Audiology and Hearing 3. Do the readings. And then when you feel confident with everything, take the chapter review question. Make sure you follow the due dates and the times carefully. This is all up in Blackboard. And check your St. John's email regularly. So for the grading, you have three exams, 15 points each, 15 sets of chapter review questions, one point each, an abstract paper, your observation, your participation, and 
in the obser in the audiological evaluation, those are each worth three points, discussion boards and class participation. There's the grading structure, about 135 hours of coursework. This is all through Blackboard. So you access Blackboard through my courses on St. John Central. Everything should be completed on time. The quizzes will close at the end of each week. If you miss a quiz, I'm not, I'm not going to reopen it for you. So here is our course topics and our schedules from week one all the way through to finals week. If you have any questions, the best way to get in contact with me is through email. Thank you.